us to the ninth episode in a series of episodes that are focused on the detailed review of the 2023 GCE Science Paper 1, which is Physics. So in the previous episodes, we covered question E, 1 through 4 of section B, and we also covered question E, 1 through 20 of section E, M. So if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing so that every time I upload other episodes you get the notification. Remember, it's important that you do extensive revision for you to ace your G12 exams. So question B5, figure B5.1 is a graph showing the variation of temperature in degrees Celsius with time in seconds when frozen water is heated for some time. So we have that figure. Then what physical change was happening to the water at the point labeled D M? So we had point e, M. So what you notice here, we have this under D degree Celsius as temperature, which is in the boiling point of water, because we are dealing with water. So if that's the case, meaning at this point, water is changing from liquid to gas. So we need to label this part. So BC we have liquid and gas, meaning AB we have liquid alone. So this is liquid. Then it means between 0 and A we have solid plus liquid. That's what we have. So the physical change happening at point labeled A, we are moving from solid to liquid, solid to liquid. So this one should be melting, which is in change from solid to liquid, like this. That's what is happening. So if you are to label this one, this will be the boiling. Then this will be melting, taking place. Where well, this is the boiling point, BP. Then this is melting point. So I just thought I'd give you more details. Question B, in which state is the water at the point between A and B? So I've already done this one, which is A and B, so this is liquid. So this is the beauty of answering all the questions on the graph or labeling it properly. Question C, when the temperature starts to rise, the volume initially decreases and then increases. State the reason for this observation. So we are looking for the reason for this observation. So why does this happen? So this behavior is a unique property of water known as anomalous expansion. So most substances expand when heated and contract when it could. However, water behaves differently between 0 degrees Celsius and 4 degrees Celsius. When water is heated from 0 degrees Celsius, it contracts until it reaches 4 degrees Celsius, causing its volume to decrease, hence the initial decrease here. This happens because the water molecules are able to get closer together as the hydrogen bonds adjust to increasing temperature. Once the water reaches 4 degrees Celsius, any further increase in temperature causes it to expand which is why the volume starts to increase. This is due to the increased kinetic energy of the water molecules overcoming the hydrogen bond, causing the molecules to move further apart. So that's the whole story. So now let us summarize this, what I've explained to you. So in light you can say this is due to the unique property of water known as anomalous 
expansion. When water is heated from zero degrees Celsius, it contracts until it reaches four degrees Celsius causing its volume to decrease. So why does it decrease? Because water molecules are able to get closer as hydrogen bond adjusts to the increasing temperature. After 4 degrees Celsius, any further increase in temperature causes it to expand. So technically speaking, this is explained by anomalous expansion property of water, which is just unique to water between 0 degrees Celsius to 4 degrees Celsius. So that's in, in short the explanation. So once you do this, you are good to go and you get these four marks. Thank you for joining me and don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you find it to be helpful. Please join me in the next episode as we look at question B6.